Hey, how's it going? So I have another unboxing. It's going to be pretty quick, but it has a pretty cool announcement. This is going to be from TP Dex. Let's check it out. So she did throw in extras. Uh, I read that was, so we'll, we'll save that for last. Let's check out these stickers real quick. There was this sticker sheet right here. It does have six different stickers. So that's pretty cool. I think my favorite out of the bunch is probably the skeleton hand with the pizza. Yeah, I, I like it. I think that's pretty cool. We got Scooby-Doo. We got the fish. Not sure what that is, but I like that one too. This black and white one. And then of course the Jurassic Park. They're all really cool. They're all really cool. So I did order two decks. We all know I have a thing for sets. And there was a set of decks on the website. So inside the bag there was... There was this blue TP sticker, and then this is different. So we got a little card, it says TP decks on one side, and information about the deck on the other. So just like it says, the mold is gonna be plain Jane, shape is a thick V2, and the sizes is gonna be a 32 and a 34. So these are gonna be a boxy shape with the plain Jane mold. Oh wait, I already said that, it said it on the card. I really like the top plies, I really like the bottom plies. So I'll start with the top plies first. Both of them are gonna be like this very deep purple. The middle ply looks like it's gonna be the same shade of purple, which is really, really cool. And here is the bottom ply. It does have a drippy smiley face. I think it's pretty cool. So we got more of that purple with some some dark wood uh, i'm not familiar with the wood i i just get the fingerboards and use them all right and i like it i think it's cool purple and brown is like one of those combination of colors that i don't see very often same thing with blue and brown blue and brown looks so good together anyways the sanding on the deck is fantastic and so is the deck construction it is super solid let's check the other one out so it's purple like the other one. We do have the TP stamp right there. Metal ply is gonna be purple as well. So here's the bottom ply. It is gonna be the second part. We have, for the most part, it's gonna be like all of that purple with the brown drippy smiley face. I think it looks really cool. I think it looks, I think they're both really cool. And it's a set complete. I forgot to bring up, this was called a Jack and Jill set. So yeah, it obviously it makes sense to have the set. So in this one, there was two stickers. One is a yellow TP sticker. And this one right here is going to be orange. And we do have that card that says TP decks. This one, this deck right here is going to be a plain Jane mold, popsicle shape, 34 millimeters wide. And she, she knows that I like purple. So we got the purple top ply. It has a very like a forest green middle ply and the bottom ply is going to be this green bottom ply which i think looks really cool it has a few different shades of green it starts with like a green then it goes to a dark green then a light green at the bottom i think that looks pretty cool but what caught my attention when i had brought out the the bags of to be determined slash it's a secret exclamation exclamation that's what it says on the card oh and that's a cool top ply we got different stickers. So there's this black TP sticker right here. We got two of them. So it has a very dark blue bottom ply. Hopefully it comes through really well on the camera because I think it looks really cool in person. The middle ply is gonna be a bright yellow. And then we have like this, I don't even know what to call it, but it's gonna be different blues and browns like swirling together. I really like that top ply. So this one right here, it is gonna be a 34 millimeter wide deck. The mold is, I guess, secret mold to be determined mold. So originally I was gonna be setting up this green one right here, but I mean, the, the secret mold is, um, I guess the to be determined mold from the secret menu, it's calling me. So that's what we're gonna do. So just like all the other decks that I've put together from TP Decks, everything was very, very easy. All the holes were drilled straight. I don't think I did it on, ca on the camera, but the sanding on this one was fantastic. And of course the deck construction, fantastic. Here's the deck, all set up, quick run through. We got black velvet on top, the deck. It is gonna be the secret menu mold. 
we have some Vortex V2 trucks. The wheels are going to be vitamin wheels from Lab. I got to get used to the weight of the of these trucks. The board does have a very solid pop feel. And even though the concave is a little bit more mellow than what I'm used to, I think it syncs up with the board with the I guess the, the height of the kicks, however you want to put it. It works together very very well. You know what? I wonder if it has something to do with the length of the kicks because that's where I'm noticing something different feeling. It could be me, but it's like the length of the nose is different compared to the plain Jane. Yeah, I'm not sure. Something just feels different about it, like other than the concave, because the concave, I can feel it like, like really quick. But I've, I've been using the plain Jane for so long. Something about it feels different. I'm not sure what it is. I know that it's different from what I normally use, but not in a like a bad way. It's just it's just different. I like the way that it performs. I like the way that it feels. It's a really comfortable uh, concave and then the kicks are pretty comfortable too so this was my most recent order well this was my most recent order this was thrown in super surprised very thankful thank you so much from tp dex and as usual everything looks fantastic everything felt fantastic yeah definitely would recommend i'll have the link to her website as well as her instagram down in the description below so you can stay up to date with whatever she has going on which as of right now she is very, very close to hitting 5,000 followers. As of the recording of this video, she's about 39 followers away from hitting that 5,000 mark. And once that's done, she will be doing a giveaway. There will be two ways to enter. I know one of them is trick related and the other one is just following the people. I'm one of them. So make sure to give her a follow and me. My Instagram will be down in the description below as well. Point is, I'm a part of the giveaway. Give her a follow. I'll repost whatever she posts about it. But yeah, I am participating in the giveaway. Really looking forward to it. So yeah, give us both a follow. Mike's a part of it too. Give Mike a follow if for whatever reason you're not already following him. I, I guess I'll include him in the description below as well because he is part of the giveaway too. Anyways, yeah, so stuff, stuff, stuff. That'll do it for this video. Take it easy. Have a good one.